the kidneys are responsible for waste filtration to vitamin d activation from blood pressure regulation to blood sugar regulation and many other biological activities so it is important for us to know how to keep our kidneys healthy so namaste and hello everyone this is dr monica dikshit and in today's video we are going to see how to keep our kidneys healthy so let's get started Now let's see some ways to reduce risk of developing kidney problems. Avoid too much of protein. So due to excessive protein consumption, blood gets a lot of toxic ketones and kidney do a lot of work to remove these toxins which increases the stress on kidneys and also kidney use a lot of water in this process to flushing these dangerous ketones away. Avoid highly processed and refined canned food. So these contains a large amount of salt, sugar, saturated fats, trans fat, free radicals that increases the stress on your kidney. And also they cause obesity, heart disease and high blood pressure. Get enough sleep. So studies have concluded that poor sleep increases the risk of developing chronic kidney disease and also poor sleep directly causes renal dysfunction through sympathetic nervous system activation and indirectly increases inflammation causing glomerular injury. Maintain a healthy weight. So obesity and overweight increases the risk of hypertension and diabetes which in turn increases the risk of kidney disease. So maintaining a healthy weight through a routine exercise and kidney friendly diet is important. Reducing activities. So prolonged stress results in many harmful effects on the body. such as faster heart rate increased blood pressure high fat and sugar levels in the blood so high blood pressure and high sugar level in the blood damages the filtering function of the kidney causing kidney dysfunction so it is important to do stress reducing activities manage heart disease high blood pressure and diabetes so high blood sugar levels damages the filtering units of the kidneys which may cause diabetic nephropathy and high blood pressure and underlying cardiovascular disease also increases the risk of kidney problems so it is important to manage diabetes high blood pressure and cardiovascular disease and also routine sugar and blood pressure checkups helps to reduce the risk of kidney disease drink enough water so water helps to get important nutrients in our kidneys and move waste products to our bladder in the form of urine if we do not drink enough water the tiny filter inside our kidneys can get stopped up and lead to kidney stones and infection so even a mild dehydration can damage our kidneys if it happens often exercise so just like a healthy diet this also helps to prevent conditions like diabetes heart disease that can lead to kidney disease but too much of exercise can also damage our kidneys if we are not ready for it so consult your doctor before starting any heavy exercise avoid alcohol So binge drinking can cause sudden serious damage and can lead to long term problems. So alcohol can dehydrate our body which can stop our kidneys from working well and can cause weight gain, liver disease, high blood pressure and other condition that can put stress on our kidneys. Still watching this video please like and subscribe this channel and share this video. Also click the bell icon to get the notification for my next video. Quit smoking. So smoking increases the risk of kidney cancer, damages blood vessels, slows down the blood flow to the kidneys which affects our kidneys badly and also smoking can affect certain drugs which we are taking to control a high blood pressure so this is a serious issue because uncontrolled high blood pressure can lead to kidney disease let's see some foods that can help us to keep our kidney healthy cabbage so cabbage is rich in fiber folate b6 vitamin c and vitamin k the fiber in the cabbage slows down the absorption of the nutrients and this gives the liver and the kidney to time to deal with the flow into the blood stream and also fiber stops blood sugar from spiking which is one of the biggest reason for the kidney damage and it is also helps to remove the toxins from the digestive tract and vitamin k is important in healthy blood clotting cabbage also contains phytonutrients that act as antioxidant and anti-inflammatory bell peppers so bell peppers contain a good amount of vitamin c folate vitamin b6 and fiber vitamin c is an antioxidant and plays role throughout the body in energy production blood flow and metabolism folate and b6 helps to formation of red blood cells they also contain lycopene which is powerful antioxidant that keeps kidney healthy and prevents renal failure green leafy vegetables so green leafy vegetables are rich in vitamin c folate fiber vitamin k and many 
other phytonutrients that reduces the blood pressure balance blood sugar and reduces the inflammation and stress on the kidneys and also increases urine production which cleans out the kidneys and reduce the blood pressure so garlic onion contains allicin and allicin is an organic sulfur compound that has some anti-inflammatory properties it also fights infection and has beneficial effects on blood pressure and can act as an antioxidant apples so apples are excellent source of fiber and the fiber in apple helps to remove toxin from the digestive tract before the body can absorb them which reduces the stress from kidneys and apples also reduces inflammation and cholesterol level olive oil so olive oil contains healthy essential fatty acids which reduces the inflammation and lowers the cholesterol level and also helps to get some amount of relief from kidney stones berries so berries are low calorie sweets that are also rich in antioxidant and phytonutrients that helps to prevent damage to the kidney cells and nephrons and they also reduces the inflammation and contains vitamin c fiber folate and magnesium like cranberry have a soothing effect on the urinary system and prevents infection ginger so ginger protects the kidney from damage caused by diabetes alcohol and dehydration so that's it for today's video thank you for watching this video if you like this video please like and subscribe this channel and share this video also click the bell icon to get the notification for my next video